The one thing I know is that California is a food lover's dream. To inspire your recipes at home, I partner with Ralph's to show you all the flavors of California. Just got back from Ralph's. I got all these delicious ingredients and I'm gonna take what I learned from Chef Manuel at Padre and I'm gonna make my version of the most delicious taco. We have our flat meat. I needed it cut really thin, so the butcher at Ralph's, he hooked it up. To the bowl, I'm gonna add all my liquids. Of course, some olive oil, some soy sauce. I have some Worcestershire sauce. I got some citrus beer, Angel City Brewery. We're gonna add some of that as well. Orange and some cumin, some garlic powder and some onion powder. We're gonna add that to the bowl as well. Some oregano, half a lime as well, ground pepper and some coarse salt, some bay leaves. Now you wanna get in with your hands and mix everything. We're gonna let it chill and soak up a little bit more. We're gonna get on our salsa. So I have some charred Fresno peppers and some charred jalapenos. Now just throw the tomatillos in there as well. The peppers, and then we're gonna add it into the blender. Garlic, charred onions. Now I'm gonna add some cumin in there. Don't forget to season with salt and pepper. And the juice of a lime. So now we're gonna add a little bit of chopped cilantro and then just mix it up. Okay, now we can fry our meat. You could use a regular grill, you could throw it on the barbecue, you could use a regular pan. The most important thing to know here is we're cooking it fast and super hot. That's the color we're looking for. Very important to let your meat rest so that all the juices and all the flavor can redistribute. All right, now Chef Manuel taught me the essentials on how to make a homemade corn tortilla. So I'm gonna do that, except I'm gonna make it a little bit different. I'm gonna take his traditional corn flour tortilla recipe and I'm gonna make corn flour cups using this muffin tray. All right, first thing you do is add some masa to a bowl. Then you wanna add a little bit of salt as well. Water, that's it. How easy is that? Then you just wanna combine it with your hands. Okay, so we got this little ball of masa dough. I don't have a tortilla press, and maybe you don't either, but that's okay. We're gonna use the bottom of a plate. Lay out some Ziploc bag plastic over here. I'd say 99.9% .9 of plates out there have this ring at the bottom. And you might think, oh, it's to stack plates on top of one another. No, it's to make tortillas, obviously. So we're gonna take the plate, put it directly over the center of the masa, and gently press down. And we're gonna add it to the muffin tray and form a cup. You wanna throw it in the oven at 400 degrees for about 15 minutes. Now, if you don't wanna make your own homemade masa dough, that's okay. Ralph also sells corn tortillas. Take your corn flour tortilla and just lightly toast it on a frying pan, like a minute each side, just until it's heated through. Now it's time to build. Starting with our warm tortilla over here. I'm gonna add a little bit of our meat. Now we're gonna add some of this delicious salsa. A little queso fresco. A little cheese never hurt anybody. Some chopped onions, some more cilantro. Bizarro version of the taco. We're gonna fill up this cup. Same layers. And now a little bit more flavors of California. Some sliced avocado. You have the classic traditional taco on the left. And you have the new age reimagined Josh Elkin version in cup format. If you wanna see more recipes like this, check out the Ralph's Instagram page or hashtag LoveMyRalphs.